What's up, y'all? Toasted Ted here once again. Uh, welcome back to my series for Cooking Fever. Uh, this will be episode three, but you could consider it the start because I deleted my data. So uh, if you haven't seen the first two episodes, um, this episode will probably incorporate both of those anyway, or at least the first one. But um, anyway, yeah, having said that, um, stay tuned and here we go. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to Cooking Fever. Um, as you can see, I'm at level one with zero out of 50 experience. So I deleted my uh, data for this game just so I can start fresh. Hello, and welcome to Cooking Fever. My name is Michelle, and I will be helping you here. Your goal is to try is to try yourself in various try yourself in various cuisines and become the best chef in town. Tap to continue. Since you are new to this, let's start from a simple dinner. Tap here to enter. Tap the play button. This screen shows the basic information on your diner, but will but we will get to that later. Let's start playing. Yeah, that screen is uh, what shows you what upgrades and like what percentage of the upgrades total you've gotten. Tap here to start. Obviously, it's going to force me to start on day one. So basically, you can consider this another tutorial. I don't know. Oh, well. Here is your first customer, and he wants a good old burger. Let's make one. Tap on the hamburger bun. Bam. Tack on the meat to... Okay. The meat is cooking. Wait until it is evenly roasted. This may take a minute. Drag, click and drag the meat. Okay. Yeah. We're just as ready to serve the customer by dragging it to him. Boink. Don't forget to collect your money. Got it. This customer wants a cola. Wants a cola. Wait until the glass is full. Your cola dispenser will fill it automatically when it's empty. Finally, take the glass. Give it to the customer and take the money. <sighs> As you can tell, this is like a legit tutorial this time. <laughs> but, um, anyway, yeah, because it's a legit tutorial, it'll probably be the entire video. You want burger or coke? What you want? Oh, what the heck? Good man, I like it. Boom, bam. Um, yeah, but uh, as you can see, it's not like a overly difficult game whatsoever. Okay, there's your drink. There's your burger. But if, if you didn't notice, when I gave her her drink, her time restarted. Okay, this guy's gonna get that low time. Because the burger had to start. Come on. Sorry, man. It's in the on the stove right now. There you go. Okay. Now that is obviously the goal and over the goal by quite a bit. So, ten bonus congratulations. While you've been playing, you have completed an achievement. Tap here to see it claim you've been awarded some coins and xp for the completion of an achievement tap the claim button to collect it i go back when you serve customers you earn coins let's see what you can get for them tap here to continue the kitchen upgrades boom use the money you've earned to upgrade any appliance or ingredient Upgraded upgraded equipment works better ingredients make up better meal which earns you more money. Tap to continue. 
Well, if you upgrade this machine, the time for the cola refill will reduce from 13 to 7 seconds. I like it. 150, what do I got? 329. Tap here to purchase an upgrade. Bam. Uh, 179 left. What can I buy? Anything at all? I doubt it. Yeah. Um, well, all right. Um, I guess that's, uh, well, here. Let's go ahead and do number two, I guess, right quick. Yep, yep. Bam, bam. Yeah, it's always a good idea to always have, if you have an empty spot for a burger bun, then always have a burger on the stove cooking. You know what I mean? There's no reason not to, honestly. Right now, there's no, oh, here. So he'll probably, yeah, I was going to say that most likely it'll take both. And now I'll need another burger right quick for the next guy, I'm guessing. Boom. Burger? No? Just a drink, huh? Here we go. Another burger on the stove. There's yours. Thank you, ma'am. Oops. Oh, I forgot the bun. <laughs> there you go, sir. Thank you. Burger, okay. It's on the stove right now, ma'am. We'll hold on just one minute. There you go. Yeah, I don't know if you guys noticed or remember or whatever, but the, uh, uh oh, what do we want? Cola? Cola? Okay. Um, the background is different, right? Like, I don't, I don't have the upgraded buildings and stuff anymore. See, that guy was kind of angry because it took so long to get his stuff. Each time you serve a customer, you upgrade something or upgrade something, you get XP points for that. Therefore, the more you play, the more XP. Oh, you little bastard. <laughs> Sorry, I keep knowing this. You gain a new experience level. Let's give you coins, gems, and unlock. Yeah, I get it. Anyway, I mean, it's basic RPG type stuff. The more XP you get, the higher level you are. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to go this way. And. What do I got? Four or something? Still don't think there's any. Ooh. Does that add? I think that might have added. Yeah, it did just add another spot. Anyway, um, yeah, so uh, when I come back, I'll do uh, levels three and four. Thank you for watching episode three on my series for Cooking Fever. Um, if you like the video, give it a like. Comment down below which upgrades you think I should buy for my restaurant or like the lobby, you know. But um, if you've not subscribed yet, please do so and uh, stay tuned for more. Anyway, I'll see you in the next one. This is Toasted Ted and I'm out.